see what she was really after. Really fell off a building for this? So important. Yeah, encrypted. Wayne Manor has seven bedrooms, two kitchens, a library, a gymnasium, a basketball court, and a movie theater. And yet I always find you here, in a dark, damp cave, in front of a computer. I like this cave. Then we should build an eighth bedroom down here. Sure, I can see the headlines now. Bruce Wayne, billionaire, entrepreneur, king. <laughs> Quite an eclectic resume. Did you find out what that um, cat woman tried to say? Uh, in the process. What are we looking at? I tried different. Such shoreline. It could be any number of things. Money, weapons, drugs, everything flows through that port. Maybe it's where Mayor Hill picked up his drug for me. Damn, I need to know that information. Can't make sense of it yet. There's still plenty of files to decrypt. I, I haven't even decrypted one of them. In the meantime, I saved you what I could. Thanks, Al. Yeah, the same couldn't be said for the bar. I had to literally pry Mrs. Zeller back away. But you'll be pleased to hear everyone has left, including Mr. Falcon. Thank God. Before the game switched from billiards to cutthroat, I'd recommend leaving the fist pipes to your alter ego. Bloodstains are much harder to remove from a tuxedo. Yeah, thanks for the interruption. <laughs> and it wasn't for you, Bruce. I was worried it might take all my good scotch. For the record, your father despised men like Falcone. Thought they ruined Gotham's stellar reputation. Back when it still had one? It can again, Bruce. Though people like this cat woman aren't helping. No. To town. I've seen her before. Hopefully she's just a tourist. I'll check the codex. Really weird, and I'm still not using it correctly yet. Found it. Not much to find, apparently. Few burglaries, break ins. Seems to lay pretty low. You could learn a thing or two from her. <laughs> you can't step outside without it ending up in the news lately. As Bruce or Batman. I stay out of sight when I need to. Define need to. Mm -hmm. Whenever Harvey calls. The guy's exhausting. Well, uh, after the press conference tomorrow, I'll mark your calendar as exhausting. Then. The media isn't good for anyone's health. Now, I don't mean to beat a dead argument, but... No one's going to figure it out. Trust me. Miss Vale noticed your injuries, so did Mr. Dent. If they put it together, well, the incident at the mayor's office... Harvey didn't. It Let's put it that way. ...long nights and close calls we endured to get here. You're in the spotlight more than ever. You have to be careful. You're right, you're right. I should have cancelled the event. But I know how much pressure you're under. I don't mean to add to it. It's okay, Ben. I know you're only looking at if we make a suit that fits me, we can trade places some night. Though I'm just not partial to heights. Uh, don't men worry, that's all. It's our gift and our curse. One more worry for the list. 
Thanks, Alfred. I thought I saw Oz. What, 20 years? As though I saw him, we were in grade school. Indeed, you two were thick as thieves. Oswald, however, took that role more literally than you. The sound of this charge of legal boxing matches, arms dealing, prison stints? That's a criminal grand slam. If I'm using the expression correctly. Unfortunately, you are. Oswald claimed he only wanted to catch up, but his behavior following his family's collapse is troubling. Why he's returning now, I haven't the faintest idea. I'll give him a chance. He wants to reconnect. Criminal record or not, he's still an old friend. A lot can change over the years. If I remember correctly, Oswald was fond of the old firecrackers in the toilet. I worry what he's graduated to. Even though you and young Master Cobblepot used to be close, I'd advise you to be cautious. But I know you can't abandon a good mystery until it's solved. I'll be careful, Alfred. When you see what's become of his park, I think you will. I need to figure out if I can change where that location actually pops up on. Where are you, Oz? Carrying around those like coins. Thank you, sir. Do you not know who I am, Jesus Christ? Are you cold, are you, Bruce? Oh yeah. So my my great adventure today. I went out to try and buy a funnel. And statue, but no arms. He just got a text message saying he's running late. What what do you expect? Let's go talk to this guy, he's he seems like a cool dude. He's smoking man. Hey. Beat it. Can someone have created like a um the Michael Jackson song, where it's like literally the chorus is just beat it. Can someone have made it that? Like the song, like just the chorus of the song, because that'd be the greatest thing ever. Watch wallet cash. This goes through you. Don't know. It's that smoking man. I got nothing. Sorry, fellas. I've got nothing. And him. The fuck? Gentlemen. Oz. Keep walking, all right? This don't concern you, twerp. You see, that's where you're mistaken. My old mate and I have some catching up. Oh, no moving! Come here. Think that'll do? Damn, he has a gun. This used to be a nice place. No lives like you don't belong. Jesus Christ, Oz. I gotta say, I, I love his voice. Hey, 
Bruce. You've got a little, uh... Hey, this new. <laughs> Woo! That was the right little scrap, eh? <laughs> Nothing kickstarts the system like a dash of adrenaline, eh? Besides, someone needed to deal with the rubbish situation here. Uh, oh, thanks for the backup. I yanked you away from your bloody ivory tower, Bruce. At least I can do is make sure you don't get shanked. Oh, that's very thoughtful of you. Captain what? Two decades. And you know what? I haven't been mugged once that entire time. <laughs> uh, no, that wasn't why I brought you in, mate. Right now, I am trying to recognize the little Bruce I used to run around this place with. Back when it wasn't, you know, like this. This park used to mean something. A place for safe, for kids, for families. People came from all over to visit. Oh, Mum and Dad, they put so much work in here. Well, those were better days. That they were. Yeah. Thought we'd grow up to be kings, I did. Both of us. <sighs> this city chews right through people. <sighs> Mum committed to Arkham. Dad ended it yourself, did he? I found this fortune. There's nothing left, but I know. I'll break the tournament. It's funny, huh? Same place that ground my family to dust. Gave you a good life. Used to run in the same circles we did. Hobnobbing parties, round the world vacations, unlimited potential. My parents are gone too, Oz. Oh no, Bruce. I know. I'm sorry for it. But I have my own feelings to tell you. There's no you haven't seen this, Bruce. You still care about something more than just yourself. Although, I was surprised to see Carmine Balcone at your party last night. Made himself right at home! That oily... <sighs> Falcone was an uninvited guest. That's it. Never want to see his face again. On that, we can agree on it. Falcone made a stack of cash and corpses a mile high, ruining families like mine. All he needs is a little... It'd be a treat to watch you be paid with. Sorry, mate. This reunion got a lot more grim than I planned. <laughs> Things are going to be on the upswing soon, though. A revolution is knocking on Gotham's door. And I'm here to let it in. Um. Which brings me to you, Bruce. You see, you drive a rock in any direction, you break a window that wade in the price is over. As the rich and powerful go, oh, you top got of this. When my revolution starts, we're gonna smash windows and cross off names all the way down. Like I said, it's not gonna be pretty. It's gonna be beautiful. I'm not your enemy, Thomas. That remains to be seen. Damn it. I've got great affection for you, Bruce. I really do. Which is why I'm with you. When this whole thing starts, make sure you're on the right side. Good seeing you, Bruce. It's very. Oh, I got some rocks to collect. Cheers. Gulag slash glitchy. Wait, I'm not quite sure what's wrong. It's either. It's not rendering properly, or... I'm not really sure what's going on right now. Because there's moments where it's completely fine, and then there's another one where it's like... Really hard movements, where you sort of see his arm... Go through about 10 frame drops. It's the Arkham Asylum, is it? Why does it just look terrifying? 